going to start off this project by signing into our Cricut Design Space account. If you have an account, you can go ahead and sign right in. What's really cool is this is cloud based, so you can work on at home and then come into the Forge and continue to work or cut using our machine. You can also create a Cricut ID using an email. Once you're in, you're going to click on the top right, New Project, and it's going to take you to the canvas. Here you're going to find a variety of different tools so you can create your own decals. We're going to look for an image of a deer. We're going to go ahead and click on Free since we don't have their subscription. And they have a variety of different deer uh, decals here. So I kind of like this black one. So we're going to go ahead and click on it and click Add to Canvas on the bottom right. So we can go ahead and adjust the size and make any changes if we wanted to add anything to it. But I'm not really okay with this decal. I feel like I'm looking for something different. So we're actually going to go online and look for a silhouette that I really like and we're going to go ahead and drag and drop that file directly to Cricut's own um, image uh, software. So we're going to remove the background or you can go ahead and manually remove it by selecting the magic wand or the eraser tool. We're going to use the magic wand since it's a silhouette but it does have an eraser tool so if you have have a very detailed image you can go ahead and edit that directly on Cricut. We're going to have, uh, click apply and choose the cut image option and click upload. This will add it to our recent upload section and we can go ahead and click the decal that we just edited and add it to our canvas. Now I'm going to go ahead and adjust the size of this silhouette and go ahead and delete the other reindeer off my project. And once I get it to the size that I want, I am ready to cut this out using our Cricut Maker in the Forge Maker space. So we're gonna go ahead and click on Make It and choose On Mat option, confirm it, and then we have it on directly on our map and then it's going to go through the three-step cutting process. We cut out our decal and we're ready to start our project. For this project, we're going to need a canvas notebook, a decal we cut out on our Cricut that we're going to use as a stencil, and transfer tape. Peel away the transfer tape from its white backing and place it on top of its deer sticker. Rub down the tape, making sure you get all the nooks and crannies. Then you're going to slowly peel the tape away, pulling the deer sticker along with it. If it's not lifting off the backing, just rub the area some more until it does. Carefully place a deer in the center of the canvas book or wherever you'd like and tape along the outside edge, covering any exposed canvas. We will be using dark blue, blue, purple, and white acrylic paint. Starting with the dark blue, we're going to dab the paint with a sponge until you cover the antlers and the ear of the deer. Make sure that when you're painting to cover all the nooks and crannies. Then with the blue, dab it from the ears to the bottom of its face and we're going to try to blend where the dark blue and the blue meet. Next, take the purple and dab it along the neck area, blending the purple and blue where they both meet as well. The purple here was a little too dark, so we mixed a little white to make it a bit brighter. Then lastly, with the white, fill the bottom of the deer and blend it into the purple. Once you're finished, you should have a nice gradient from dark blue to whitish purple. We have overblended just a bit, so our gradient looks a little more like dark blue to blue. Take a small brush and paint tiny stars around the deer using white acrylic paint. 
To make smaller specks of stars, load the brush up with white paint and start flicking the brush around until you're happy with the amount of stars on your canvas. Wait for your canvas to dry for a few moments, then slowly peel away the tape and deer sticker off the book. You will slowly start seeing a deer silhouette appear. And just like that, you have a beautiful Starry Night Deer notebook. You can either gift this or keep it for yourself. Thank you.